Hi, I'm Kitty and I'm going to show you how to draw a cartoon superhero. So first up what you'll need is an A4 size piece of paper, a pencil and a rubber. So to get started um, what we do is we draw an oval for his head. Like that. Then we come down, bring two little lines down. And I'm going to draw another oval, just more horizontal this time for his chest and then another one for his torso and another one down here and just a slightly lower one for his legs then we just stick another oval there and another oval on that side like that You draw some upside down teardrop shapes for his calves, or his lower legs, and then again on that side, and then half circle, I mean half circle, an oval and an oval for his feet. Let me just come back up here and connect these ovals by drawing a slightly angled line. And then I'll just straighten off those shoulders as well. And then we draw an oval for his upper arm. Then another oval for his forearm on that side. And again, there. And there, like that. And then a circle for his hands that'll be on his hips. Kind of in a superhero type pose like that then um, for the detail on his face we just put a line kind of about halfway across and then we draw kind of like an almond shape or leaf shape for an eye then the same on that side. Let me just draw a circle. Another circle inside. And then on this one as well. Like that. Then we just bring a little bit of a slight curve line down and across and then slightly rounded lines there and there to show nostrils. And then we're going to draw a mask. So this mask uh, I'll do the ears first, so we just draw a little bit of curve line there and there. So we'll draw a mask along underneath his eyes and then up over his nose, then back down that side like that. And along. Then it's going to come over his whole head. So I kind of think this guy could be. A superhero of the sun, like Super Sun Man. So we're making his mask quite big. And then you could have like little sun rays coming out the side of his head like that. And then on the side. To show his sunny disposition as well and then we'll just put a line around there to show the holes for the eyes like that and then we'll give him some eyebrows kind of painted on eyebrows I guess over the top of his mask there Then we're just going to broaden his jaw by bringing that down, that line down and across and in, and then just yeah, just squaring off that jaw there, like that. 
head. And put a line across for the mouth. A slight bump there and there for the lips and then down underneath like that as well. And then for his cape, I'll kind of do like little teardrop shapes there on the side for the main bit of the cape and then two lines around to show the back, the neck bit and then a circle with a leaf shape and a leaf shape for the tie like that and then the cape will draw on soon once we've done the rest of this body here so I'm come down squaring off those shoulders again like that and then into the arms round off and then he's got gloves on so we're going to make like a triangle shape there where the gloves come out from his hand and then we're going to square off that oval slightly and put a thumb in there so it looks like his knuckles are against his hips so he's standing in like a superhero pose and then again on the side come down and then we're just going to add a bit of a triangle there like that and down down and then just square off that knuckle bring it into his thumb there like that it's going to come down this outside bit as well into his knees down this side like that then I'm just going to grab my rubber and just rub out some of these guidelines because we're going to start putting more detail into his costume so let's rub these out take that up there Let's do some the lines around his helmet as well. His cheeks. Like that and just fix it up. And then we're going to add um, just a bit of a tool belt in there, a utility belt. Just drawing some curved lines like that. And then just adding some lines down like that. And then for his other part, this question, we're just going to put some rounded lines in there. And then because he's Sun, superhero of the sun, of the sun. I'm gonna put a circle on his chest to give him like an emblem. So when you're drawing your own superheroes, you can think of different uh, different things to use to um, signify, to symbolize them. So in this case, it's the sun. So we'll draw a little circle in the middle, and then like we've done here, just lots of sun rays coming around like that 
And I'll just draw another line in there. Like that. Then to give it even more detail, I'm just going to draw a zigzag pattern across. Like that. And then on his arms. On the sleeves. And again here as well. give him some sun rays on his gloves so just by adding little triangles then on his legs too we're going to make some boots so we just do a triangle out like that and then down and then down triangle out like that and then down and down and around into that oval and a little rectangle with a circle, a circle, a little rectangle with a little triangle for the sole of the boot. And then again on the side, a little rectangle, bring that down a bit more. Rectangle, little triangle, and up and around for the sole of the boot, like that. And we draw another zigzaggy shape there. Just kind of adding these in really to give it a bit more detail. And then we'll draw some sun rays on his boots there too. Like that. I'm just grab my rubber and just rub out this part of the guidelines on the boots. Let's go back and fix that up. Like that. Then for the cape, we kind of bring it down kind of into a, a like a curved curvy line and then wave it up like that and then take it back up to there and then to give it a bit more detail just bring some lines in just to show where those kind of ruffles are happening like that Just to add a bit more detail we can do some shading so we'll just do some gradient shading here by just lightly pressing down and then just um releasing the pressure as we get further up those little sun rays like that and just around his eyes just that side of his mask as well just kind of round my pencil just to give that kind of roundy shape to his head and just under his eyes as well and down the side of the face okay, and I'm just pressing quite lightly just quite lightly like that and then under his chin I'm just pressing a little bit harder And then just releasing that pressure as I get further away from that chin. And again here, just shade that a little bit. Sometimes they're even just giving a little bit of a light colour can help uh, lift your picture. And then here, I'm just going to do a light shade. Just a light gradient so pushing down slightly harder releasing the pressure as we get further up like that and then on the side like that and then on the gloves just down there just 
pressing slightly harder on, on this bar and then loosening that pressure again here like that and like that and then just on the side of his costume let's add some lines or some gradient lines there utility belt again just pressing slightly harder and releasing that pressure to get further up the belt and again here so the sides coming in pushing a little bit of pressure down and again here releasing the pressure again see so closer to the middle and just do a bit of shadow on the inside of his legs as well Again here on those sun rays. And again here, just pressing down and releasing that pressure just to cause that sh gradient shade. Like that. Then on the boots, again, just pressing down and releasing that pressure like that and then on the side With the cape, I'm just going to make it quite dark coming out behind him. Seeing the cape is right in the background. Just to get him to stand out more. Like that, and then come down here as well. And just release that pressure as I get further out. And just where these lines are too, I'm just going to give that, just make that a little bit darker, just to show where the folds are happening. Like that. And here. And here again. So there you have it, how to draw a superhero. Hope you enjoyed doing that. See you later.